hand comb work. There. That's like cave women used to do. Hey guys, it is Wednesday here in Daily Grace, and you know what that means. Look at her go. Reviewing, reviewing, reviewing something for you. So my television has been broken for two weeks. But finally, the Time Warner employee came and fixed it today. And it had me thinking that this is the fall, which means there's all new TV shows available to all of us to watch. And so I decided that I was going to review the new fall lineup of television shows, though I haven't watched any of them. So I'm going to review them solely based on their promotional posters. 666 Park Avenue, whoa, which is about um, all the characters on the show have rigged a chandelier to fall on this old man wearing a pinstripe suit and throughout the course of the season we get to see whether it falls or not and someone in the background is reenacting the scene from Titanic where they sex it in the old car. Animal Practice is actually a reality based game show where a group of perfectly proportionally ethnic middle aged people dress up as hospital workers and need to transport a dog on a gurney from one end of a hospital to the other. It's hosted by a monkey. Take that, guy who hosts Survivor. Arrow on the CW network. Okay. Let me guess this character's name. Alexander Skarsgård. He will protect me with all of his scars. Ben and Kate! It's about a group of friends who have a female friend that has Benjamin buttoned herself. And the hilarious hijinks that happens when a human ages backwards. Do they have to walk backwards? I don't know. Ben and Kate will tell you. Chicago Fire is about the Chilean miners that moved to Chicago and unfortunately the apartment that they all moved into caught on fire. Those guys can't catch a break. Elementary is about two well-dressed people who only have an elementary school education and they're trying to survive in a leather chaired world. Go On is about a group of middle aged people who all take ecstasy all the time except for Chandler. Guys With Kids is the web series I tried to write three years ago except in my world it was called Stay at Home Dads, Sads. But Guys With Kids is about three men who work at the sunglass hut kiosk in the mall and all have kids and various baby Bjorns and love to roam the streets of an unidentified city. Made in Jersey about a real doll that was made in a Jersey warehouse that cannot say no to the bump. What kind of hijinks will she get in with a briefcase? Malibu Country is the Reba show with a different cast and more plants. The Mindy Project is a show about a group of Caucasians doing their best Jim Halpert impression and Mindy judges them adorably. Nashville, the town where girls love glitter and their tits are bigger than they probably are in real life and they buy furniture that's strange and put their feet on each other weirdly and chaos and sex ensue. The new normal. It's the Real Housewives of Atlanta, but every other cast member aside from Nene Leakes has been replaced by wasps. Partners, everyone is gay. Whoa, the new fall lineup looks like their television shows. Cool, I give the new fall lineup Three and a half grace faces because everyone was beautifully photoshopped. I love it. I love it. What do you think? Oh, cool. Bye. Revolution 
what happens when the Hunger Games come to TV with different people and a Ferris wheel that is threatening.